Hello, welcome back on board commanders. My name is Sebastian Holt and I'm going to be your pilot for today's video and in today's video we're going to look at upgrading our FSD drive. So what we did in the last video is we went to see Felicity Farsi and managed to unlock the ability to begin modifications. So as we go to our side panel here we can scroll up to engineers and as you can see Felicity Farsi in the top there if we click on her and I might, I, whilst I was there I pinned the blueprint um, and as you can see here, we can click View Pinned Blueprints. So if we go here, uh, the mod modification I went for was increased FSD range. And as you can see here, she wants some atypical disrupted wake, wake echoes. And I'm now going to show you how to gain them. So for one, you need to make sure you have a wake scanner installed on your ship, uh, just as I do, and assign it to an appropriate fire group. So what we're going to do now is going to find some wakes out in space and the best place to find wakes I find is near starports like I am right now or near nav beacons. So let's have a quick look around. As you can see on the radar you have all these white squares. These are actual FSD wakes and if you just target one you'll see one there that says high energy FSD wake and we're just going to make our way towards that. Now I believe the FSD wake scanner I have installed on my ship was a 1B which has got a range of about 3 kilometers so we need to get within 3 kilometers of this wake so we're just going to head towards this like so as we get there we're going to power down and stop so here we go within 3 kilometers and I'm hoping I'm still outside of the no fire zone or she will get a warning for um, using the weight scanner as they see it as a weapon but I'm going to begin to scan and as you can see there you get that scanning interface come up and it's starting to fill up boom there we go so as you can see in the top right it says collected decoded atypical disrupted wake echoes so now what we're going to do is we're going to head back to the station and once I'm there um, I'm going to come back and show you how to add the modification to your ship. Okay, so as you can see, we've docked on a starport right here, and we're going to now upgrade our FSD drive. So what we're going to do is go down to starport services, open that up. We're going to click on this tab over here in the right-hand panel that says Remote Workshop, and we're going to click the FSD right here. So we're going to upgrade our 5A FSD drive. That's the one we want to do. As you can see, the first one here is saying that we needed these disruptive weight echoes have actually got six so I'm just going to generate that modification yep it's going to this is going to tell the, the downsides of it and the upsides of it so it's going to increase the power draw increase the mass uh, and decrease the integrity of our FS3 drive which I'm willing to do and there we go we now generated that and we've now uh, increased it so i think we have to do that again because this bar is only half full so it's just as well i've got more than one so we're going to generate modification again and there we go and now we can select the second modification so we can work our way up the tiers and it will increase our fsd range and that's how you go about um, modifying your fsd drive so you have longer jumps so it makes them long trips um, easier with less jumping in between so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've really enjoyed this video, leave a like and be sure to join the crew by subscribing. Thanks for watching.